20 of the most dangerous toys off Timu, and I am going to be testing them, starting with this one. Oh, Mom. Oh. You're gonna do it. I don't know why this, oh. oh no. I know why this is dangerous. Did I go again? No. I could definitely get hurt on that thing. This next toy is a dog with no head. It's a little bit creepy. Look, she doesn't even like it. Where's it going? Oh no, is he coming after you? <laughs> Maybe it's dangerous because it's scaring kids. Jason, should we make a blackjack with this? I wonder what he's gonna do. Oh man, oh no, oh no. This mechanical dog is so ferocious. Oh. Literally no one likes this toy. Yeah. Yeah. What are you doing to it, Dave? She, she turned it off. Wow, all done? All done? Oh, yes. I think we took it to our max today. <laughs> I am gonna be pranking Rebecca with one of these toys. Stay tuned because this is gonna get ridiculous. This is my danger meter where I'll be rating how dangerous these toys are. And I think this ball hopper goes kinda right here. And the robot dog, it's not that bad. Just a little scary for kids. These toys from Timu are called airplane shooters. Check this out. You can turn on the lights. It lights up and what you are supposed to do is you're supposed to be able to <laughs> Come on. I was just pushing it. Now we know why these are dangerous. All you do is you like go like here. And you're supposed to shoot it up. Let's see how high it can go. Go for it, yep. Look at that. Oh. Matt, you should have moved. This is why Zadie is not here right now playing with these. How's this thing? Oh, oh my gosh. Matt. Come on. Now I'm going to shoot it up in the air and see how high this can go. Three, two, one. Oh, woo. Oh. Are you kidding me? Do you want to try? No, I, yes, I. Oh, oh my God. Okay. Come on. Let's go rate this. On the danger meter, I'm rating this airplane the top of the orange. What? Are you kidding me? What? No way. This thing's way up here. It's <laughs> dangerous. No, maybe it was just the person using it. Come on. This next toy from Timu is a hat, but it's actually a game. What you do is you push a button, music starts, and you try to eat the marshmallows as they spin around until it <laughs> stops. This thing looks like a disaster. Obviously, it's rated dangerous. I have no idea why. My tongue can't even reach them. This is impossible. Oh, it's going, it's going. Ah! Wait! Oh! Ah. Ow! Ow! That hit my eye. Ow, that hurt! Good luck. Here we go. Did the battery die? I think you broke it. I broke it? That thing's dangerous! I'm just trying to hit it. I broke it? You broke it! I still can't see out of this eye! It hurts! Let's go raid it! Ow! I think I have mascara in my eye too. Ah! This hat you would not think was that dangerous except I hit my eye! It still hurts! It's going in the orange. This is a remote control car watch. The car is in the watch and you are supposed to put it on and then take the car out and you can control the car with your watch. The world's biggest watch. I mean, it's it's not subtle. Look, it's like a watch from the future. You better watch out. Good one, Matt. Now that the watch is on, let's flip this open. Oh. Place the car down. Oh yeah, this is cool. I think Zadie actually might like this one. She doesn't like a lot of these and they're kind of dangerous so she's not allowed to do all of them. But, I mean, I don't see how dangerous a little car could be. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, move the push the other button. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna let her do her thing. This doesn't seem that dangerous. No, not at all. I mean, it does go a little bit fast, but. Okay. You're all done? We turn this off, zay, and then look. She's reading the instructions. You put the car back inside. Let's put this away for later. Okay, bye. Let's go rate this. This car went fast, but Zadie played with it and loved it, so I'm going in the yellow. Not that dangerous. This is a fidget toy. Now, in the US, we've had the fidget spinners, we have slime, we have all these things for fidgeting, but you have never seen something like this. This guy has a very hairy face. So what you do is you take these tweezers and you tweeze the hair off his face. So gross. Let's see if this relaxes me. Oh, the, these hairs are so fine. Oh. Oh gosh, that's a long hair. So disturbing. Why are they curly? I don't know. Also, what happens when you pull out all the hair? Oh, this one wasn't as big. Oh. Oh, it's still in there, it's still in there. I got two, I think. Why? Oh, <laughs> I don't no. think this is dangerous. I just think it's gross. It's kind of like a pimple popper maybe where it's like gross but still satisfying. It looks like a nose with a face on it. Okay, my face has never been this hairy so I can't really relate to this. But Matt, maybe I could start tweezing the hairs off your face when I'm stressed. No, it's not satisfying at all. It's satisfying, but let's rate how dangerous 
dangerous it is. The hair tweezer is kind of gross. Yes. Kind of satisfying, but not dangerous at all. It's a fidget toy, okay? It's for stress. This next item is a parachute, and you want to throw it up in the air and try to catch it. Now I'm gonna see if I can drop it from the top of our stairs and run down and catch it. And Matt, you're going next. Well, I'm definitely catching that. Three, two, one. Ah! No, that is the worst parachute ever. That guy fell so fast. If I had a parachute like this, I would not be alive to do this video. Looks like it's my turn. You really think you're gonna be able to do it? Yes. Good well, luck. Really you did. You're gonna be surprised. This thing is dangerous. Just don't crash. Three, two, one. Oh, 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 don't get hurt, don't! Oh. I told you, that thing is dangerous! You shouldn't use that as a parachute! I'm going again. Okay, it's not gonna happen. Oh, 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 actually! Woo! Oh. It's possible! Still dangerous! You could've fallen down the stairs! That's how you do it. If you threw these up in the air and it landed on someone, it could kind of hurt, but it's not that bad. So, parachute guys, where do you think, Matt? Maybe right here? Yeah, for you. For me, definitely in the blue. Oh, brother. This toy off Timu was a little bit challenging because it's written in another language. Thank goodness they have pictures. I think I figured it out and put this into the stencil, make something. I'm gonna make an apple. I put some of the powder in here. I don't know, Zamfam, we're just gonna try it. Okay, so the, ah! These are some of the strangest toys. Adding the green. Oh, I thought you were gonna do a green apple for a second. I'm doing a red apple, green leaves. Zamfam, have you ever done this before or seen this? It's kind of satisfying, it's actually. It's very satisfying to watch. Now that I have it, I'm gonna place it in here. I think that's it. Put the lid on. Okay, and then I'm supposed to push these two yellow buttons. So, Go. pushing one, I'm pushing the next. Oh my gosh, what is supposed to be happening with this? It's like jellifying. What does it say happens next? I can't read the instructions. The general confusion on your face. Tells me that you got it. So, we obviously don't have yellow. They did not provide that, even though that's what the pictures show. You just kind of put this at the bottom. I think it'll string up. Rebecca? So, basically, just, oh God. I'm just going like this. My noodles are going to be more like udon noodles. It says I'm supposed to do it, but I don't know why it's floating so high. And now we're going to make the noodles. I'm going to add pink noodles. Let's go. Looks like it's jellifying. I feel like you have a big mess in there. This is kind of like slime. It's ah! It's actually, I was gonna say satisfying, but this looks like an egg. Might have been because I didn't quite use the string on it. Now, oh, whoa! Don't eat it, not food. Take the apple, <laughs> place it on top, and wait, fake ramen noodles that you can pretend to eat. But you can't really eat. That's probably why it's dangerous. I mean, this looks like food. What kid wouldn't put this in their mouth? I know Zadie would. All right, let's rate it. These noodles you should not eat, but they're not that dangerous. I mean, as long as you don't eat it or try it. These are disgusting. Yeah, there's still an aftertaste on my tongue. These toys are called Bite Me Dinosaurs. No, they're not called Bite Me That dinosaurs. is, that is the point of these. That's the most ridiculous name we've they're ever heard. They're supposed to bite your fingers, look, like this. This is why they were made. I guess kids just wanted to see what it'd be like to have a dinosaur or bite you, but. Oh, it's kind of, it's got a strong bite. Yeah, it kind of hurts. I, I'm pretty sure that's why these are considered dangerous. They hurt, they're stuck. Have you tried to like put it on your face at all? No, I would never, that would hurt. But look uh, at this. Rebecca. Look at this. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Uh, ow. My face, my face, my face. What? It's stuck. Get I it off. I can't, I can't get it off. Matt! Oh! oh gosh. Oh! You need me to... hey. oh. oh! Why would you buy this? Why would you have it buy Why would you buy this? Oh! Matt! Obviously, these are a little bit dangerous. Let's rate it. And, ow. Oh man, it left teeth marks. I hope oh, kids know dinosaurs were a lot bigger. Could it leave a mark at all? <gasps> Matt! Is it bad? Stop. Gotcha. That was dumb. <laughs> I knew. <laughs> Woo! Oh, go Frank. on. Game on. When I saw this caught on Matt Lips at first, I thought this is the most dangerous toy, but then I saw him pranking me. So I'm gonna put it kind of right here because when they bite your fingers, it kind of hurts and it left a mark. Zampan, make sure you stay tuned until the end of the video because I'm gonna get payback to Matt and I'm gonna need you guys to screen record it. This next item off Timu is supposed to be a little pond where you go fishing. Now that the water's in, watch this, Sadie. Whoa. Whoa. Here, come over here to fish. Ooh. Oh, oh, I caught a fish. 
gosh, she's just using her hand. Okay, I have no idea why this was rated as dangerous. The only thing dangerous about this is making a mess. I saw a big recall on this because it was leaking. Is yours leaking? It's not leaking yet, but maybe we should do this outside and not in the living room. If others leak, this one isn't, so we got the good one. Zamfam, have you played any of these fishing games? Oh no, it got caught oh, in Oh, oh careful, careful. Maybe that's why it's dangerous. Kids could pull it off and then you get all wet. Also, Zamfam, Zadie is going to be two this month, so comment below any birthday theme. Zadie, what do you want to do for your birthday? Do you want pizza? No. Do you want ice cream? No. Do you want Elsa and Anna? No. Oh man, she's about to hit the terrible twos. Zadie loved this thing. Not dangerous. This is a miniature claw machine. Oh, do <laughs> you like it? So I'm gonna go for this teddy bear right here. Okay, I think I, I, think I have it. Oh! Bring it over, bring it over. Press down. Yeah. Oh! I got it! Zane! Oh, I'll push it down. Oh, they got another one. Now they have friends. Look, Zadie, that could be like you and if you have a sibling. Do you want a sibling? My kid. You didn't really answer the question, but that's okay. We're gonna assume that's a yes. I don't know how anyone considered a miniature claw machine dangerous, but I'm putting that right here. I mean, you couldn't even get into it. There was nothing dangerous and those toys were soft. This is a flying saucer rocket that we are gonna try right now. The rocket's already set. You're gonna try to catch them when they fly up. I'm not sure why this is dangerous, but you're supposed to press down really hard. Come on. And they're supposed to fly hey, up. I'm gonna press it this time. Oh! Hey. Oh, got one. This is actually pretty fun, Zamfam. Who can catch more? Oh. Oh. Ah! I got none. I got one. Oh. Don't hate the fat girls have more skill. Okay, just, just one more time, just for safety. Oh my gosh, we have to rate this. Oh, oh, oh. You didn't catch it again. Okay, tell the Zamfam why you didn't catch it. I was in the wrong position. No, because your wife is more skilled than Come you at on, this. Let's read it. I'm better at games, what can I say? These weren't that dangerous, but they could land on your head, so I'm gonna put that in the yellow. This right here is called the twerking box game. I am not joking, that is the name of it when I ordered it. I don't know how dangerous this is. I don't know why people think. Maybe it's the one twerking that's dangerous. The point of this is you're gonna shake it and you're gonna try to get these out. Now I cannot twerk and I don't even try, but I have won a contest doing this game, so I'm pretty good. Comment below how many seconds you think this is going to take. Go! I hit one! I did it! Not hard at all. Oh, 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 come on. That's probably why it's dangerous. Oh. I can't breathe. For this game, the balls were big enough where no kid would choke on them, so I'm gonna go probably like right there. Are Not you, dangerous at all. Are you kidding me? What? This is the most dangerous one of all. Why? No one wants to see that again. This is a 3D printing pen and I have never used one of these before. I don't even know how to do this. If it's dangerous, I don't know why. Is it gonna catch on fire or something? Oh wow, I'm gonna stack it and make a heart. You know what, I'm turning my heart into a triangle because I can't do the heart. <laughs> Whoa, this is satisfying. They say that this is dangerous because it's really hot. Okay, it, it does look pretty hot, so I can see why it's dangerous. Why is this advertised as a kid's toy? It says three plus on the package. Uh, there is no way I'm letting a three-year-old use this. I can't even use this and I'm an adult. And voila, my abstract art, which is hot. Comment below if you want this and I'll send it to you as a necklace. This pen wasn't dangerous, but extremely hot. So you wanna do it with caution. So I'm going right here. This game is called the suspension blowing balls. And the reason that this is dangerous is it's a choking hazard. I mean this, I would never want Zadie to have. It's the size of a marble. She could swallow it, choke, and it would be not a great thing. The way this works is you blow into it and the ball is supposed to go up into the air. Whoever can keep it up the longest will win. Three, two, one. But yours touched the basket. But it stayed up. No, does that count? All right, best two out of three. Sam fam, do you think that counts? I tried to keep mine up. <laughs> this one right here. Cause Zadie could totally choke on the parts on that toy. So yeah. Sorry, Zadie, you're not playing with that one. This is a pinball machine. Turn it on. That started fast. Ah. Oh, you try to get them. Look at me. Okay, well, that was intense and stressful. I'm pretty sure that this is considered dangerous because of how shocking it is when you hear that music. Like, I have anxiety just hearing that. Oh, there's another one. Oh, oh, if I catch this, you all have to subscribe. 
Oh, I caught it. That means all of you watching this video right now have to subscribe so we can hit three million. So subscribe, smash the thumbs up. Oh yeah. Very annoying, but not dangerous at all. These are called walking beams. And I guess it's practice for when you walk in the snow. You go on the front okay. and I go on the back. You lead and I'll follow. Right foot. Now go back, one. This is good. Now that we are on it, we're gonna try to do it to music, okay? So just what? step to the beat. Ready? Just call that out so I know what foot to use. Okay, we're gonna go with right foot first. Okay. Right. Oh. Okay. Oh, we're doing it, pretty good. Okay, go back together. Oh, couple goals. I can't believe we're doing this so well together. Let's just freestyle dance a little bit. That. Make sure that you guys are subscribed so we can hit 3 million. Come on. Click and watch this video right here and let me know some more pranks. Bye guys.